Once the post office is closed, your, your community kind of loses its identity. Marsha Hardin and her family own the post office in St. Patrick, Missouri, the same post office that is known for its special cancellation stamp and the same office that may be shutting down. We had a meeting, I think, uh, last um, September, October, uh, when the man from the Postal Service came and he had a, a meeting with everybody in the community and said that it was um, uh, slated to be closed. The St. Patrick Post Office is part of a Postal Service plan to possibly shut down almost 3,700 small post offices nationwide, but no official closing notice will be made until May. We're not sure yet, so um, we're kind of hoping that you know, it will be, will be overlooked and, and everything will be fine, but we just don't really know at this point what's going to happen. Father Paul Hartley is the pastor of the Shrine of St. Patrick Parish. Each year the church does a fundraiser with the post office for St. Patrick's Day. With the possibility of the closing, the church may also suffer, so the town is preparing. Well, we're going to try to make arrangements where that will, there will still be a postmark for St. Patrick's Day. Um, that the, we can maybe work out something with the Postal Service that would, they would be able to put up a temporary uh, postal uh, station that we can continue to uh, mark St. Patrick's Day in that special way. But until then, the town wants to focus on this year's St. Patrick's Day. You know, despite the, the things that seem to be going on, that we believe that this St. Patrick's Day is going to be a, you know, a sign that things are going to be uh, continuing still keep on doing what we're doing and uh, hopefully the Postal Service will see how important this is and uh, let us continue with the post office here. Chris Zinagiri, KHQA News, St. Patrick, Missouri.